This here is a robotic cat that we previously reviewed, and this here is an all new robotic water fountain called the Pet Google. The two together don't make any sense because of the fact that robotic cats don't actually drink water, so we don't really need this guy right over here. Now, this here is actually an all new product that just came out, mainly because of the fact that it features a smart app integration allowing to go ahead and see how much water your real pet consumes. Now, this here is designed to be something that you can go ahead and set up in a matter of seconds, and it has an eight filter filtration system making it great for your pets to go ahead and have nice clean water all the time. Now together we'll be unboxing it as well as trying on seeing exactly what it's all about as well as giving it a test run with a real cat then none less to say. So without further ado let's go ahead and get started. Alright, so this here's our packaging, this here's our box. Overall, a pretty cool looking box. My kids thought that this was actually a toy when it first came in. I'm like, no, it's actually a robotic water fountain for a cat. Then they thought we were getting a real cat, but yeah, no, we're, we're here today. So yes, really cool box. Uh, let's just go ahead and open this thing up. All right. Now, the fun thing about this box is it actually serves as two purposes. It's actually a box, and then on top of that, it's actually a little house for your cat. Uh, and how do we open this up without breaking it? Ah, here we go. Velcro! <laughs> okay, so it's Pet Goo Goo. So in terms of contents, this here's everything that we get. Uh, so off the back, we have a quick start guide over here talking about how to go ahead and set this up, as well as there are different stages for our system over here. So just looking at it, it definitely has a really cool appearance to it. I love the fact that they have a little bit of graininess built into the actual like water fountain to give it more of a natural appearance, almost like a stone kind of feel there. Look at that. Uh, and then this will just kind of open up like this. You can actually see the pump right over here, as well as the filter as well. Now the nice thing about this is the electrical components are completely separated from the actual housing itself for the water tank and then the water pump itself. This here is going to be our filter uh, for the water. So this here is going to be our eight layer filter. So that's kind of neat. Now, uh, aside that, the way this would work is it actually works magnetically from my understanding. So from there, you just gonna go ahead and place it so it's sitting against the back of the wall like this. Place it in here. And that is about it in terms of how you go ahead and set this up. Now the power port is gonna be here on the bottom uh, in which you use the power adapter that it comes with. And then this wire here will run over here. That is that in a nutshell. Uh, so let's go ahead and add some water to this next and see how this works. All right, so I went ahead and added the water. Uh, and now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna drop this in here just like this. And then place that into this particular unit and then plug the wire into the wall. Look at that, it's working. So that's cool. So you got like a little water pump. Very, very quiet. I can't even hear that it's on. That's how quiet it is. Uh, from my understanding, a lot of water fountains like this, you can actually hear it kind of like splashing about, but this is actually a very gentle approach. And the beautiful thing about this is that the electrical components are completely separated. All I do is lift this up. And look at that, all dry, no wires, no mess, no, nothing has to work with clicking. It actually works via magnet. So the moment that bottom magnetic filter touches it, like that, it'll start working. How cool is that? So this is great. So a pet can go ahead and drink water. Uh, now the nice thing about this, it does have its own app integration. So let's go ahead and try this out and click on add device. Uh, and then we connect via Bluetooth. Okay, and then I'll click on uh, pet water dispenser. And then from here, you can go ahead and add your pet as well. And now we're adding it, and from there, it looks like it's uh, connecting to the Wi Fi. So, the nice thing about the filtration system is that, for instance, if the cat's or the dog's hair gets in it, it'll actually filter it out. So, it's always running clean water, which is really nice. All right, so time for the real test. Does the cat actually really enjoy this water fountain? Now I went ahead and set this up to see how it behaves. And surprisingly, at first it was a little bit curious, but once it actually went ahead and went to the water fountain, it just kept drinking. And I love the fact that the app will actually show you a real time footage of how much water it drinks. So you can see here as we're kind of updating it about, it is drinking. And from there you'll see that, well, 
right there, 62 mLs. So this is pretty neat just because of the fact that you can get a daily day readout of how much more water the cat drinks as this is beneficial for its health and particularly making sure that it's hydrated throughout the day. Now, as you can tell, it really does enjoy it and then the filter itself will filter out any kind of hair and different things like that. So overall, it makes it great in terms of being able to use it for a cat. Now, as we kind of update with the app here, you can actually see it'll show the different things from the day to the week, to the month, to the year. And I mean, right now you can see as it continuously goes, it will refresh it and oh, there we go, 89. So yeah, there you go, that, that's actually really good. So you can see the cat just kind of interacting with it and playing with it. Now in the back there, you can see it kind of trying to see where the water source is coming from. And I think that's actually kind of cute too, just because of the fact that it is very curious on how this works. And with that said, I mean, it's actually very beneficial to its health and overall is a great design. Now, aside that, the cat was really friendly with it. And once it was done playing with it, it actually just kind of left it about. Uh, and you can just go ahead and leave this running without any issues and it's simply easy to use and I think the cat really did enjoy it. Uh, one, because one, it's not intimidating and two, it's got a really nice clean look which is always welcoming to any cat out there. All right, well, there you guys have it. Overall, a pretty cool design concept. Some things I really do like about it is the fact that one, it's really quiet and really easy to use. Uh, it does have a great appearance. It has a really nice clean cut feel. And I can imagine any pet would absolutely love this, except for this little guy over here. Now, with that said, if you guys have any questions at all, comment down below. Otherwise, we'll see you in the next video. Take care now. Bye-bye.